Hey, Internet. Oh, man. It's been a while for this. Uh, all right, here we go. You haven't seen me for several months. You've seen some VidCon vlogs that I've put out every once in a while, and there's still one left to go. But for the most part, you haven't seen me. And for some of you, you've never seen me before because my dear friend Todd decided to put some videos up where he plugged my channel and randomly some of you came over here, which, like, thanks for coming over. That's very kind of you. Welcome. I'm Abby. I normally make videos more frequently than this, but I haven't made videos in a while. The main reason for that is because back in May, at the end of May, I moved from Maryland to Montana. I currently reside in Missoula, Montana, where I'm working with Cinema Studios to create online video content. In classic Abby fashion of videos, I am filming using the natural light coming in from my window, but today is a cloudy slash sunny day. It's been raining and now it looks like there's hardly any clouds in the sky, so maybe the lighting won't change that much, but I can tell right now I am super bright. So if you aren't new, one of the first things you might notice is that my hair is purple. Uh, that's a big thing that has changed in the past couple months. It's a long story, but basically everybody in the house here dyed their hair different colors for, you know, just for fun and I ended up with purple. The other thing is that obviously I'm in a new location. I did put a video up in this room like when I first moved here, but this is a different view and there's new furniture and there's plants. I have plants, like real life plants that I'm trying to keep alive. So on the surface, it's pretty obvious that things have changed, but I feel like the changes go all the way to my very core. This has been such an interesting adventure. I feel like I keep learning things, new things every day, and I keep having new experiences, and I keep being more and more glad that I did this thing. My initial thought when I was thinking about making my next video was that I need to recap every single moment that I've had since I got out here. Unless you were following me on every single social media platform, you've probably missed some stuff, and even if you have been following me on those things, you would have missed some things. So my first thought was like, I need to put all of that out there, and I need to tell you what I've been doing, but it would kind of feel a little bit like my year in review video, so I'm gonna leave a little bit of that for then. But there are some really important things I do want to share with you. So the first thing that's kind of crazy is that I legitimately have ridden or driven in a car from the Atlantic Ocean, the east coast of the US, to the Pacific Ocean, the US coast of the US. I've driven the entire length, not all in one span, a significant portion of it in my trip from Maryland to Montana, but I've been so many places and I've seen so many new things. I've seen so many areas of this country for the first time. There's a significant portion of the middle of the country that I had never seen. There is, like, I went to Utah for the very first time. I went to Arizona for the very first time. I've been in Nevada for the very first time. I went to Las Vegas randomly. I saw so much of California. Uh, I saw Oregon and Washington. This summer, it felt like no matter where I went, I was overwhelmed with the absolute beauty and majesty of the natural world, as cheesy as that sounds. I've been to Glacier National Park a couple times and it's probably one of my favorite places on this planet. It's so epic and amazing. And even just the views from outside of my window, like I can look out now and see snow-capped mountains even though it's only October. Yeah, we've already had snow here. So one of the major things that has changed since moving here is just being able to see so many cool things. But in addition to that, I kind of moved out here knowing some people, <laughs> but not really knowing people. I mean, there's only so much that you can learn after spending a couple days with people or talking to them online. Like, that is completely different than saying, okay, I'm gonna come move out there and I'm going to live in a house with a bunch of you and I'm gonna spend so many hours a day and yeah, it, it's just massively different. So when I moved out here, I had all of these thoughts like, on one hand, potentially, I have this whole group of friends who I will get along with and be friendly with and have a great time with. On the other hand, I could be completely wrong and they could absolutely hate me and it could be the worst time ever and I could go from being super alone in Baltimore to super alone in Missoula. And I'm happy to say that that did not happen. I mean, Today, I'm coming to you after having spent last night cooking and carving pumpkins and watching movies with a group of friends, and it was one of my favorite nights that I've had here in Missoula, just because it was, it was just low-key and fun, and we were doing Halloween stuff, and just everybody was having a good time and being silly, and it was awesome. And I have found so many people here who fit different parts of my personality, who I feel like I 
can connect with in certain ways and I don't know friend wise it's just such a different thing than being where I was for the past year. On the cat front, don't worry, that's still a thing. There are two cats in this house. There's Index and Radius. Quickly made friends with those guys. Index and I are best friends. And just in general, Missoula itself is a really cool place. There's a lot of really interesting things. Over the summer, the community in Missoula is really great. There's lots of events to go to and outdoor things and like farmers market and festivals and things. It was just, it was a cool way to experience Missoula, to come in at the beginning of the summer and get the chance to see all of all of everything. I'm getting to see all of the seasons, including fire season. We had crazy wildfires and there was one particular day, it was actually Labor Day, where we were not supposed to be outside for very long. So that was crazy and a new experience. Basically, Missoula has just been a series of new experiences and it's been really amazing and I wanna share more about it. I have some ideas, I've talked to some of my housemates and I know that some people would be willing to sit down and have conversations with me. So maybe I'll get the chance to like introduce you to everybody and uh, talk about some new things. I want I want to start doing this again and I've had this block with these VidCon vlogs so I'm going to continue on and eventually that Disney Day video will get out but let's let's start with this. In addition to my own videos, I should have mentioned this before, but if you're looking to find me in other videos on YouTube, I am on Michael Aranda's vlog channel, what I'm doing right now, and I am on Twitter and Instagram and Snapchat and all of these different places, and I post there very frequently. So if you want to see more things from me that aren't fully made videos, uh, that's where you would want to go to see them. Actually, in a week I'm going to be headed back to Maryland to go to my family's Halloween party. I am really excited about that. This is the first time I'm going to have gone back to Maryland since I moved out here. So I'm trying not to feel super emotional about it, but I'm feeling kind of emotional about it. <laughs> I want to hear from you guys. What have you guys been up to? What have I missed? Because I know that I have missed so much, just so much, and I'm so sorry about it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see y'all later. This guy wanted to come say hi. This is Index. <laughs> hey.